Alright, so we come back and welcome to my master class today with me. Um, this class was supposed to be held a long time ago, but sorry for the delay. But nevertheless, I'm super excited because I'm going to be pouring out a lot to you guys. But um, I want you to be willing to work with me. So one thing I will tell you first is to get your book and your pen because it's going to be one of the most expensive and classes you have attended online that like it's just going to be pure value over and over again something you will want to watch something you want to come back and say ah osmosis should blow my mind i am assuring you it's going to tremendously reveal things to you that you never knew existed online or you never knew was possible online especially for you that have not created any online business before you have not done anything related to online for this class is for you but for you that already started and probably want to scale well maybe i'll organize another class in the future that will teach you how to scale an online business but for this class it should teach you how to start how to start for those of you that don't know or you have not done or you knew or you are finding it difficult to excel in it so you want to know what you are missing out well this class is for you i'm going to be sharing with you what the business of the new economy entails and how to tap into this new money well. So this is going to be revealing a lot about business, about online business and what the new economy. I'm going to be strictly talking about the business of the new economy. So it's not just generally any online business. It's strictly tailored down to the business of the new economy. This new era, where is the money pumping into? What factors or what things or what criteria are controlling the wealth flow or the cash flow? current economy that's what we are going to be learning today so welcome i'm your host moses Obulo, also known as Bob Moses, as you can see it here so quickly let us let me give you a desk climber so that they will know that okay um there is nothing that is actually guaranteed now all the results i will be showing you in this training are true 100 percent verifiable however it is not a get rich quick scheme i'm not promising you get rich quick or get money overnight business no or any magical process involving getting you quick results no it's all about you being dedication everything you're going to be seeing all the results you're going to be seeing was all through dedication consistency and hard work look at it consistency hard work so if you're not involving this three um virtue into your into what i'm going to be teaching you today you might likely not see the result you desire so if you are looking for a shortcut or to get a, a get rich quick scheme method from this training i am sorry to disappoint you you won't be finding any in this training are you getting me there is no promise or guarantee to make my kind of result in the shortest time possible are you getting me? there's no guarantee every outcome is affected by different factors but one thing i know that is sure is that if you are doing your best you will see good results that will definitely that you will definitely be proud of at the end of the day so what you need is dedication and focus and hard work are you getting me consistency so whatever result i'm going to show you is true and verifiable why i'm showing this result is to know that okay this thing is actually working though know? it's working for me and it's working for a lot of people i have shared it with so let us go to the next slide so who am i who am i who am i who am i who is this guy my fine face <laughs> so you have seen maybe you have seen it in my landing page before you go here so who am i so my name is Moses Ogulo, as i say i'm popularly known as boss moses the ceo of insta media uh insta media is my advertising agency my whatsapp media and also i am the academy a business learning academy that's the platform you are currently getting this content you got this contact to attend this webinar from or probably saw it online Whatever the case might be, but this is who I am. I am personally interested in teaching everyday people how to make money legitimately online. Are you getting me? I'm currently a graduate, or I'm a graduate currently serving copper right now. I'm currently serving copper, and I'm also the convener of Cash Out Strategy Podcast on Telegram. If you're on my Telegram channel, you might have seen the podcast, my podcast series. I think we have done about five series so far, and I've talked over two thousand persons. On different ways to make money online legitimately, legitimately from the comfort of their home. 
even with no laptop. Yes, even with no laptop. And that's the same thing I'll be sharing with you today. We are paying close attention. So I'm currently currently have three online business that I'm doing that is generating over six figures for me. something i've done with other people and I've, I've shared with other people and they have learned from me they have implemented it in their own life and they are seeing crazy results but first of all let me show you my own results um from the year i started so i started um 219 though but i, I didn't take record of that year 220 was when i started seeing more results 220, uh, 219 was my year of growth like i was growing and learning 220 i started doing better 220 as you can see here my total this is my bank statement as you can see 220 um this online business has been a good saving for me so 220 i made a total or, or i did it over 7.2 million era in that year that's for this account i have other accounts that i didn't check their bank statement so that's for this that's what as you can see january the bank statement is january 2020 to december 2020 I did about well about two point um two point I mean seven point two million sorry seven point two million as you can see so that's then when we, I was running an repair program for a platform called LPV and most of you might remember NNU back then that kind of site so that was all we were doing I think I did that then we went into um networking I did good that year too as well went into networking so twenty twenty one. 2021 was a year that was very loud for me. Kind of, I did a lot. 2021, that was last year. So I didn't want to be like, ah, it's only 2020 results you brought. Uh, it's, old, it's old glory. So I'm showing you recent stuff. 2021 is not that far, still recent. Like that was last year. Um, So this total of what I did last year, as you can see my name, bank statement from 2021 to, to I mean, from January to December 2021. As you can see, I did way over 17.3 million of my online business. This is my online business. I went from 2020 As you can see, so this is something I've been doing for me and it has been giving me results. All the business, all the business I've been doing has been giving me results. But it was not like this before. Before I talk about my 2020 results, it was not like this before. 2019, I was struggling. 2019, I opened a shop that um, I felt that was where money is going to come. A lot of people might have opened shops that paid. Maybe you are still struggling. Yeah, I opened the shop. The shop didn't even last three months before I fold. I fold up. I ran out of business because I couldn't manage the shop. The, this, the income was not coming as I expected. It was a betting shop. You know these bet, um, betting shops. I opened a betting shop with, with over 500 plus rented shop. Buy all the things I needed. A lot of these stuff that people come and be giving you advice every day. Ah, it's because your TV is not facing front. So that's why you're not getting customer. I went to a more TV that will face front. Somebody came and said, ah, it's because you don't have chairs. That's why I went and called Camila to do chair, more chairs. Ah, somebody said, ah, it's because your this is not showing you sports. I say, ah, I went and did this is what good thing to show sport. Another person came and with another advice. Kai, it's the thing that will work. I was taking advice from different, different people and I was struggling and yet I was not seeing results. That was me 2019. I was struggling and I failed. I failed woefully. So 2020, 2020 for me, I came online and I started with my advertising business first of all. That's Insta Media 2019. That's what I started with first of all. I started growing and growing and growing and growing the media team. It became something that started fetching me money almost every month. There was a month I would, back then in 2020, we were doing over 400k in sales, selling bets, betting apps, selling um, Netflix login and all. That was for me. Then I grew into networking. I started doing for search. That's where I made over all this money I, I am showing you in 2021, about 17.3 million. So there was one of my accounts that I, I went to do bank statement. So I wanted to show more results. And when I checked at how much I made that year, well, transaction I did that year, 22 hours, like Jesus. If I showed you, I will share a screenshot. Even this one said it's looking like a screenshot to a lot of people. 
I mean, Photoshop to a lot of people, but nevertheless, there's something I know I've done. I don't have to show people that know me very well know what I've achieved online right from 2020. So I didn't want to show that one because ah, you know, eh? <laughs> if you have made that much, why are you doing all these online things? But it's, nevertheless, it's something that involves growth and finding the best of yourself. 2020, I didn't do classes. I didn't teach. I was really focused on my business, making money. 2021, I did more of networking. I didn't teach too. I was focused on getting down lines and all. 2022 that we are in currently. I think I started my uh, mentoring and coaching journey late 2021. That's when I started it. I found out that I, I figured out that I had passion for it and I started engaging in it. Do I used to do some kind classes back then in 2020, but it wasn't so serious as, as 2021. So if you are down to that, ah, these are past glories and all, then this is my 2020 result. As you can see, um, 1st of January 2020 to February 2028. That's like 60 days. So in the last 60 days I've made over, I've been able to generate, not just made, generate over 1.1 million era on online. And I do this through sales and through my rendering of my services and teaching and coaching people. That's the business I venture into. But there are so many other businesses you can do online that still generates money, especially when it works with the kind of thing you love or your passion or something you can easily or function in. Now, let me show you the result of my students that I've taught to the class on how to go about this online business and what they are doing for themselves. So this is one of my students, Clint Hart. He was one in one of my class that I tied to um, Total Profit Domination. So um, look at what he said. He said, in, in your absence, I did a discount to 80 people, 10K each, and I made well over 840K. I said, wow, for your forest class, you say, yes, your ad, I use that your ad mastery strategy, about your TW master class did the magic for me. As you can see, it's telling me about the class where it came on. So um, this is the result one of my students is doing over 840K. This is another result another student is doing, say, so yes, say, ever since I decided to play, Close attention to your status update. I have, I have seen how not to take taxi marketing can be at times. I simply decided to put some strategy you shared into practice, and I grew my team. Okay. So, so that made over 400k as you can see in three days the 3k is money spent on ads so don't think there is something money growing anywhere his 3k is something spent on ads and he was able to generate over 400k for one of his class as well so this is something i, I share with people i teach somebody prince Uye is a 16 years old guy i think 16 years old guy he's making over 50k in a program that he's doing to appreciating me for my coaching and teaching this is another student of mine making over 50k I showed him how to do go about his own online business, how to sell, how to market it. I mean, and so, so these are results from people that are close to me, that are learning from me, and that directly or from my status that I'm sharing this knowledge with. So, you being in this class is of benefit to you because you're going to learn something that is going to help you do better after this section. So, let us get down to what I hope to achieve at the end of this class. So, for you. To have a better, uh, what I hope to achieve is for you to have a better approach about things online. A lot of people are so fast to condemning everything that has to do with online marketing or online stuff. They feel that ah, everything online is scam. A lot of people that feel that whatever results you show them is scam, a lie. It's not possible. But we are in an era where 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 people that just shake their bum bum online or just dance or say some things are making more money than the graduate or you make up doctors and what. Physicians and even bankers or bank directors, I'm telling you of the truth. People just come online and dance and or go and check your TikTok influencers. They make way more money than a lot of people that work corporate uh, corporate um, offices. This is the money online that I'm talking about. So you not necessarily must be into marketing or selling online. You can do you can make money from content too. People make money from content. So don't be leading your mind to thinking ah anything online is kind of like nobody if you make that kind of money it doesn't work like that the era is changing the technology is advancing everything and creating more opportunities for people to make money that's what i want to share with you the 
size of the new economy. Now I want to save you from yourself on how money is currently being made and how not to miss out of it. There are a lot of ways that money is being made currently that a lot of people are missing out of. Some people are so old and so used to that their old pattern of doing things and they feel that's how life is. Well, this class is here to open your eye. So I want you to, what I hope to achieve is that I want you to also consider only your own online business and knowing the steps that are necessary for you to start yours. So another thing I also hope to achieve is for you to start your own journey of acquiring a high income skill immediately, almost immediately at the end of this class. I have an offer for you and I hope for you to get into it because it's going to change the thermostat of your finance almost immediately if you hop on that offer. So you need to understand, I want you to also understand the four position online business is built. And I also want you to be able to start making money after this teaching. And lastly, I want you to jump on my offer. These are the things I want I want to achieve at the end of this class. And I hope every one of them, you are part of it. You end up being the guy that now have better approach or the lady that now have idea of where money flows or the, the lady that I have just started his own business her own business online or the guy that just started her own, his own business online after this class the guy that acquired a high income skill after this class has been doing way over six figures every month for themselves so this is the content of the class first of all we are going to talk about the money mindset if you don't understand how money works you might likely not be able to make it if you don't understand how it flows currently you might likely not be able to work. acquire it The second thing we are going to talk about in this class is the evolution, the evolution of money and the almighty money formula. The evolution of money and the almighty money formula. That's the next thing we are going to be talking about. So the other thing we are going to be talking about is the entrepreneurship journey, how to get started on it, how more, what it entails and all. Now what we are going to talk about next is what an online business is. Next, after that, we'll talk about the economy, the new economy and how to function in it. After that, we'll also talk about the skill set of the new economy and we'll talk about how to start an online business. We'll talk about four positions for online business. Four positions online business is built around. Then we'll lastly talk about platform. I think this platform is something you will engage in to start making money for yourself. And lastly, my offer that will help you get started. I will not end up teaching you this far and not giving you a direction to start. That's why my offer comes last. But first of all, I want to give you value up front. So that you appreciate the essence of the offer and know that it's for your own good. Let it not look as if, oh, I want to cajole you to something that Nigeria don't like people giving them something that if they want to spend money on. So I want you to see it as something that helps you at the end at the long run. So that you come back and appreciate me just like how those other people Came with their testimonies and i'll be able to share your testimonies online i post testimony literally every day of my students and what they are doing online crazy stuffs that you too can start doing yourself so who is this class meant for i want to save you a lot of time and so i want to tell you ah if you don't fall under this category of people just close this stuff and go and find that favorite netflix film and watch or go to bed and sleep probably you get better results from doing those things than Staying here to listen to my teachings. So if you have a negative mindset about online marketing, then this training is not for you. If you hate online marketing, you hate everything that has to do with online business, you hate all these online things, then please, please, please stop here and just move on. Let me save you the stress. If you are looking for a way to get rich quick, ah, with no effort, then you are clearly in the wrong place. Because whatever I'm going to be sharing with you requires your effort and not by putting 10 naira and waiting for 20 naira tomorrow. A lot of people are just too, are too conversant with that mindset. That's why a lot of us were scammed last year from different investment platforms. I was a victim of it as well. And um, I've learned my lesson. I've grown to do better. So if you are a 9 to 5 or a salary earner looking for legitimate way to earn extra income, then this training is for you. If you already have a job or a place of work, you're already earning at least 30, 40, 50 K or 60k a month but you want to add an extra income to it i remember when my dad was earning that that much in when he was working when he was still alive 
I believe one way or the other, he was feeling hard, which he knew something he could do that would not take all of his time, but he can still make extra income. Well, this class is that miracle, is that prayer point you have been praying for. I get him in. So, if you are here and you want an extra income, then this class is for you. You are an online business owner who is not making money, but need an additional source of income or knowledge to help you boost your sale, then this class is for you. If you like the idea of starting a business online, but you don't know how, then this class is for you. So welcome once again to my master class. Here I'll be revealing all these things or all your desires for you. So let's start with the first one on our list. The money mindset. I hope you have gotten your book and pen because this is where the, the whole scrutiny, the whole changing, the whole celebrating bliss, the whole fire is going to be coming on you. For now, things you need to know about money. Money is a mindset game. It is what you perceive you can conceive. There is no two way about it. You can only go as far as you know. So information is necessary for your growth or for your money game. Knowing. So money is fully a product of what you know and what you can achieve with what you know. Results. You are a full representation of your mind. So you cannot do beyond what you don't know. That's why it is important to keep knowing. You only attack things based on the frequency your mind is operating on. For you to see far, you need to grow what the sight of your mind. Anything you don't have now is either you have not perceived it yet, or you aren't working towards what you already perceived in your mind. So if you don't have a millionaire yet, means you have not perceived a millionaire, and you cannot perceive it if you don't have any in any idea on how to it to get seen it works. So first thing I want you to know is that money is always in abundance. This is something you should take note of. There is no scarcity of phone at all. That's why your car companies, your phone model, keep producing better devices so that you will buy. Have you ever thought of it yourself that, ah, what happened to the old phones that we are using? Why, why is this guy producing his own 13 Pro again? When we have not used the old one finished? It's because they know this principle. And money is always in abundance and you will keep buying because of what the value you perceive of that phone you keep changing that car you keep buying that new phone because they understand vividly money is always in abundance there is no scarcity of phone because you don't have don't assume me the next person doesn't have so that's the money mindset the money mindset you should have there's always money don't ever feel ah there's no money nobody can afford this who told you People are complaining there's no money. People are buying a house of one billion in Banana Island. There's a, a real estate lady I follow up to. She sells houses of 700k, 700 million, 900 million in the Keja Ikoyi houses. People are buying before you see, she, she writes so. Um, it's the same country, everybody is complaining there's no money. There is money in abundance. You have to learn how to collect. And that's the essence of this class today. You have to learn how to position yourself to collect this fund. So secondly, you need to know that you will attract more money if you help people achieve these three things. Now, if you want to make money online, these are the three things you, help, you have to help people achieve. Now, money is also a, a people game too. Money is also a people game. So if you don't have people, you can't make money. I, I see people saying, ah, I don't like anything that has to do with talking to people. It will be hard for you, uncle. Uncle, that I don't like talking to people. It will be hard for you. <laughs> if you want to actually make a lot of money, you need to learn people skill, people oriented skill, presenting value up front. So these are the three things that you 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 need to achieve. You help people achieve in order to make money or to get money from them. When you help people make more money, you make money for yourself. When you help people save more money, you make money for yourself. I want you to help people multiply more money. You make money for yourself. And I'm going to be showing you how we can be able to achieve these things. Helping people make more money. Helping people save more money. And helping people multiply the money they already have. Your wealth is in the next person's bank account. If you have not heard it before, I'm telling you now. The money you are looking for is in the next person's pocket. All the money you have right now is someone else's money. You don't really own any money. Same way you will collect money from other people is the same way other people will collect money from you. Same way. 
It gets worse when you aren't collecting money, enough money from people. When you spend for that omo, that soup, people have collected money from you. When you spend for that fuel, you are, people are collecting money from you. It gets worse when you have nothing to collect money from people for. I'm not talking about be, 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 borrowing or begging. I'm talking about strategically positioning yourself as an attractor. Wealthy men are collectors. You need to learn how to collect money from other people strategically. That's what business helps you to do. That's what business what helps you to do. Even scammers know this. Scammers know that ah, they have to collect money from people. That's why they provide you with ridiculous offers to steal your money. Only for you to realize that you have been deceived. They know that for you to make money, you have to be what? A collector. So money, money making involves people. Don't run from it. Don't be like, ah, I don't like anything that will talk to people. I don't like that will, anything that will make me beg people. You guys see me? So money, so that is to tell you that money is a people game as well as I said. So I hear people saying they don't like anything that will do with people. I don't want to talk to people. Well, that, that's poverty calling. You have to change that mindset. You have to change that mindset, Asa. You will always need people if you want to make money. There is no making money without people. So lastly, on the money mindset, lastly, money is a product of self worth than it is a strategy or a, a platform game. People think it's by strategy. People think it's by platform. People depend on tactics and, and framework. They don't know it's a self what and game. You can copy people and still not get the same results. That's the truth. Self what has to do with how much you have put into yourself as an asset, both in terms of behavior and response to your environment. People sense value from afar. People sense value from afar. Self what. Assets. How much of an asset are you? How much of an asset are you? How much do you believe in yourself? People who believe in themselves will do better than you who doubt yourself very often. Believers show up every day. How much do you believe in yourself? Believers show up every day. Not, not once in a while. Believers constantly grow themselves. They don't feel they, they know everything. They learn every day. They grow themselves. Believers. Those are people that know their self worth. Believers learn, unlearn, and relearn because they understand things are evolving. Are you a believer? Are you a believer? Are you evolving alongside with everything? Or you are still used to that your old you, that your that your you that feels ah online thing is hard, online thing is difficult, online thing is calm. So they allow themselves grow. Believers allow themselves grow. To a person that function in an economy instead of complaining about everything. Anything they point out to the bad government. They point out to the bad government. Believers allow themselves grow. So you have to know that you are an asset. You have to grow yourself every time so that you can function properly in any economy. Instead of complaining. Ah, 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 bad government. We know the government is affecting us as well. But still that same bad government, people are buying Buying 2022 Range Rover. <laughs> Quite an expensive thing than living life at their own terms. You too can live life on your own terms. If you understand this principle, let me go over them again so that you understand. Number one, I told you money is a mindset game. So you have to reinvent your mind, you have to reprogram your mind to function in the abundance frequency. To know that ah, there is no scarcity of fun. I just need to learn or know how to collect strategically through my business secondly you have to know that money is also you attract more money by what helping people achieve things saving more making more and multiplying more you make more money by helping people are you getting me so it's a people game you don't run away from people don't say ah, i don't like anything that these two people know are you getting me so lastly i told you money is a self what game is more of a self worth than it is a strategy or a platform game so you increase you improve on yourself you improve on what you know you improve on the value of around yourself 
That's it. Once you can do this thing, money will not be a problem. You'll be able to flow or function on any economy. Before we, before we, before we, we dwell more on this mindset game, let us talk about the, the money evolution. Let me brief you about the money evolution and the almighty money formula. Now, money always changes form and ends in different areas. I believe you all realize that money is actually the value we placed on it. Before now, we were doing strictly trade by butter. Before now, we were doing strictly trade by butter. You bring one right cup of rice, I will give you one cup of curry. You bring one hen, I will give you one cup of curry. You bring two tuba of yam, I will give you three cup of beans. You understand? Straight by butter, you bring something to collect something. That was back then in the era of was slavery. Until they now made money into calories. How many of you remember that? Calories, beads. Then money now became a paper tin. So every era, money evolves. In this current era, money is going digital. Money is digital now. You can transfer without going to the bank. Without going to the ATM. You can run transfer on your phone. Money is not digital. I remember back then, before you won't get 100k, you have to go to the bank. You sleep. Join one long queue. So every era creates new form of money. And hence, money moving to. Your ability to know this era allows you to operate better and function in a way where you, where you make the most out of every economy. Your ability to know. So this class is giving you the early advantage, the early mover advantage, because now you know the era you are in and you operate better and you function well. So you make the most because you have been informed. So it's simply your ability to catch up with trends. And catching them early gives you a better room to achieve more than others. Knowing this today will liberate you, I'm telling you. This class will liberate your mindset. You change everything you know about money. You'll function properly now and you'll not be given an excuse. That is bad government. I understand where money flows, so I know how to position. So before, I, before we talk more about money, let's dive into the money evolution first. Before we talk about the almighty money formula. Now, before the First World War, we were in a slave trade era. Where we have just noblemen. We had two classes of men back then in the in the slave trade era. We had the noblemen and we have the common men. I know it's beginning to look the class is beginning to look like a history class, but don't worry. <laughs> I don't make it look like that. You enjoy it, I promise. So we had the noble men and we had the common men back then in the slave trade era. Now money were more in the hands of the slave masters and those that were born into realities. They were born into wealth. Now, the common men were our forefathers they are, that were born into slavery. They were shipped from one country to the other. Back then, if you if in the, if you're in the slave area, you were born poor, you would die poor. There was no chance for you to even grow rich. There was, no, there was no opportunity. There was no door, no window for you to become rich. Once you are born poor, you will die poor. So, But if you are born rich, you grow rich and die rich. There's no poor for you. Are you getting me? The, back then, in the slave era trade. So we had only the noble men and we have the common men. The common men were those that were uneducated. They were uneducated. So after that, after the First World War, after the First World War, we moved into the industrial era where we had the middle men. That is, this is where education came into place. We had the, the middle men. The middle men now became a teen. It, now, it was not possible for the common man to now go to school, get job, and actually grow rich. Money moved into the industrial opportunity, into industrial opportunities. If you are a graduate, then you were very valuable. I remember back then our father's uh, era. I mean our father's time. If you are a graduate, then if you go to school, I remember my dad would tell me if you just go to school, come on secondary school, you can get a job job as a clerk, and you're a big man in the village back then. These were the times where education were more were, were more of a good mind, not now anymore. Education were, was an edu was the, the, the oil well then. Going to school was more relevant than now. I'm not saying it's not now. I'm saying it's is is less is <laughs> less appreciated than it was back then. In in that era it was valued. In that era it was valued. So the middlemen were, were not given opportunities. I mean, the common men were not given opportunities to become middlemen. A lot of people still didn't take that. They felt, ah, it's farming. They still missed out of it. 
they still missed out of it. They didn't go to school. They miss, I, I know a lot of us, our parents didn't go to school and they complain and they tell you, ah, it's because I didn't go to school. That's why we are in this, we are suffering now. And they are not making school now look important now for us. And a lot of us are, are forcing ourselves. I'm not... <laughs> It's good, it's good. School is good. I'm not condemning school, no. I'm telling you that now it's not that valid as it used to be. We are not feeling now school is, is the is the gold. It's no longer the gold mine. That's why you're in this class. I tell you, this class will change your mind. So after the First World War, we moved into the industrial age, the era where, where education was more of a value, where graduates were, were valued and getting jobs was the main thing. Then the Second World War now happened. After the Second World War, it brought about another era. Now that era is where power and money moved into the political states. Before the Second World War, kings, emirs, were, were rulers of empires. We were the ones that decided the fate of any country or states. We didn't have presidents or governor back then, before the Second World War. It was um, religious entity. I say religious was traditional entities that were that were in power, were in charge. But after the Second World War, power now moved hands into presidents, into the governors, into prime ministers. We now had electoral power, unlike before where we were where where power was inherited by birth. So after the Second World War, we now moved into the industrial era. Now in those era I mentioned money flows was based on your position. In the first era, I told you that the slave masters and the royalties were more in positions to make more money. In the second era, I told you that it created room for middlemen, people that meaning that graduates could enjoy the room of making more money if they just go to school and get jobs simply by getting jobs. Now, in the third era, I told you it became the democracy era, where people now had to say of who ruled and controlled the direction of the economy, opening more rooms for jobs and innovation. After the Second World War, the era of democracy came in this political era. We, were, we could not vote. We could not give power. We could not shift power. We could not take power from people's hands. It was no longer by bet. So money was now pumping more into jobs and innovations. It created rooms for more jobs. The third era created rooms for what? For more jobs. Now the current era that we are in is already playing its card. It's another, it's another war. Another war is around the corner, but that war is not this one that uh, Ukraine, Abi, Russia is threatening Ukraine. This current war that is already in order, that is already playing its cards, is a digitalized war. That's where money is going into now, the digital market. That's the online space. So if your business isn't based online, you'll be missing a big chunk of money. That is flowing around the, this current era. So this brings us back to the importance of this class, how to build an online business. So you now know, you now understand the, the money flow. So in the first era, if you're a slave master or you're going to reality, ah, you're a big man. The second era, if you went to school, you graduated, you get a job, you're a big man. The third era, if you're more into political things, even till now, say, a big man. But this current era is in the hands of those who is playing the online game. I'm not saying playing Candy Crush online. <laughs> I'm talking about business built online. COVID-19 came and taught us a very good lesson. Shifted the dynamics of everything. People that businesses were built online experienced massive cash flow. Even pond sites were having more traffic. <laughs> so the online base changed everything for people that were, were online. So that's the importance of why you need to own a business online. And, and, and again, the almighty money formula functions better, functions better on the online space. I'm going to explain why. And I'm going to explain how the almighty formula works. The almighty money formula. So the almighty money formula is, um, okay, is based on results. No longer the amount of time you put into work. So you spending six hours, eight hours, twelve hours in work does not determine how much you make anymore. It doesn't. In this, sorry, excuse me. 
in this current economy, the internet space has given you room for the formula, for this new formula, for this formula to help you make more online and apply it in the fiscal world. Let me tell you how this works. So, why, why it functions properly or why this uh, online team money formula functions well for the online space is because the internet has created a boundless environment. There's no boundary online. There's no boundary, but in fiscal, if you don't have this guy, you can't go back. You can't go to the UK. You can't, you can't go to the, you can't go to America. You can't go to Dubai. You can't reach people out. But the internet has provided means for us to reach people in Dubai, for us to reach people in UK. You cannot do business with somebody in India. The internet. So the almighty formula, this is the almighty formula. The almighty money formula is problem plus solution equals money. The problem is your client. The solution is you. The money is both for you and your client. I'm not saying you both of you are sharing. If you solve their problem, you make money. And if you help them solve their problem, they make money too. So it's a happy end. Solution. Money plus solution equals more money. So if you are looking for money in this new era, find problem to solve. Is that simple? The, the, the number of problems you can solve is what guarantees the amount of money you can make in this new era. The type of program you the type of problem, sorry, you solve also determines how much you can charge or collect per solution. The type of problem you solve also determines it as well. So if you solve a one thousand naira problem, you will get a one thousand naira reward. If you solve a, a, a one million problem, one million naira problem, you get a one million naira a type of problem. This is where the online space makes this formula very effective because it allows you to place the game of frequency. The number of people you can reach is what I mean by frequency. If you can solve a ten dollar a ten dollar problem for one thousand people, that will help you generate what over ten thousand dollar in return. If you can do this in a you can do this in a week. You can do this in a month. You can do this in a year. It all depends on your capacity to reach what more people with your solutions. So if you can solve a problem of hundred dollars for one thousand people, that's over a hundred thousand dollars in return. Same goes to one thousand dollar problem. So the type of problem you are solving gives you room to charge more. People who solve life related problem charge more. Your doctors, they charge more. People who solve, also solve money-related problems also charge more. The value of the, the market puts on the problem that you are solving increases your chance of making more. That's why a pure water seller hawking around Lagos won't make as much as a doctor in a big pharmacy. The market value differs. And the number of people a pure water seller can reach in a day is limited. But with technology now, online, you can, if you are selling pure water online, you can sell to a million people in a day without even leaving your house. That's why I told you the frequency game, the online space helps this online formula functions well. So for you to make money currently, you have to find people's problem to solve. Right now, I'm solving your problem of what? Your curiosity about online business. If I'm to charge for this class, I will make money out of it. I get him, even if it's ten dollar. So let's talk about the entrepreneurial journey. We are getting towards, getting closer to the end of the class. I believe you have already get, I already started getting value so far from what I've, I've explained or what I've been teaching. The entrepreneurship journey. Who is an entrepreneur? Let me talk about who is an entrepreneur before I talk about the entrepreneurship journey. So an entrepreneur is an individual who sets up business or businesses. Online, anyway, sorry, not less than online. Identify and solve problem. You see, solve problem. An entrepreneur is somebody that sets up business. Identify and solve problem is creative, innovative, opportunist, a risk taker, self starter, and open minded with the hope of making profit from an enterprise. That's what an entrepreneur is. So, uh, Entrepreneurship is just the art of being of being an entrepreneur. 
But one thing you need to know that is that entrepreneurship is not for everyone. So I won't cajole you into feeling like, ah, it's meant for you if you don't have the will or the desire for it. It can be very stressful, I swear. Entrepreneurship can be very stressful. But it's the most rewarding thing to thing you can ever set yourself aside to do. Income as an entrepreneur is not static. It is progressive over time once you know how to do it. And to succeed fast, you need the help of what? A guide, a mentor to take you through the process. Take note, nobody was born an entrepreneur. All the billionaire, millionaire you see online, on this online space, we are not born experts. They were not born like that. People learn these things. People learn these things. So if they can, you can as well. The worst thing that can possibly happen to you is that you will fail and start and still have the opportunity to try again. All the gurus you see online took consistent practice to get to the level that they are. So it wasn't luck. Luck has nothing to do with it. Luck has simply has nothing to do with it. So you have to make up your mind to be an entrepreneur. So let us go down to the section where we talk about what an online business is. So business, first of all, let us explain what business is, then we'll talk about the online business. So business is only any activity making one's living or making money by producing or buying and selling products such as goods and services. So anything that involves you making money is a business. Anything that involves you making profit out of it is a business. Simply put, business is any activity or enterprise entered into for profit. The word online means anything that has to do with the internet. So online business is any activities you do online to make money. Are you getting me? Any activities you do online to make money. So anything you are doing online to generate income is an online business. That's simple. Just join the two together. Okay, so the new economy and how to function in it. What the new economy entails, the new economy is governed by skill sets and tech. We are in a global digitalization era where virtually everything is powered by technology. And people who are value-based oriented, people now pay people for value. Without any digital skill sets, you can't survive the new economy, I am telling you. So going to go to a degree was what paid the bill. Now, skillful people are making money more than degree holders with no skills. Skills increase the value you need to function in this new economy. If you don't have any skill currently and you have a degree certificate, I'm telling you that you will not make money as much as somebody that has a skill set and a degree. People now reward people based on skill. Companies now hire people based on skill, not just your degree. Your degree is no longer enough. The skill set you carry. Is now what people are willing to pay for. The value, the extra value you have as a person. For you to make money in this current economy, pay must concur. Money is an exchange of value. Value is created when you provide solutions to other people's problems. And you can only do that through skill sets. So this skill set that helps you what? Create your own online business. It is from this skill set you can leverage on to make money for yourself. Without it, you are just another regular individual who hope everything will be alright one day. Your country is getting bad every day, I'm telling you. Especially if you are Nigerian, I'll tell you the truth. You might not express a better Nigeria in this our generation. You might not. Like the problem is deeply rooted. So you need to be a, a sovereign nation. You need to be sovereign. And you can only attain this level of sovereignty by being a value person. A person of value and skill set is what position you to do that. Let me check the next slide. We'll talk about the skills of the new economy. So somebody came to our PP, I mean our CDS one day to talk, uh, a human resource officer. And he was sharing an idea how she went to get a job in ECOWAS. She studied English, I mean like, um, French. And they asked her which skill does she has to back it up. She says she doesn't have any skill. They said her French was polished and was clean, but for the fact that she doesn't have any skill, French cannot do the work alone. They need somebody that has an extra skill set. So what is that extra skill you have? What extra thing can you do as a person? 
or it's just paper you have or it's just paper you cannot function well in this new economy without skill set everything is going digitalized right now i remember back then when we 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 needed to go to the bank before we could transfer money money is not transferred without going to the bank cannot order things online and get it delivered to your doorstep technology if you don't have ideas of skill sets you can't function well in the era we are going into so you need skill sets to leverage on what are these skill sets that's what i want to share with you quickly what are these high income skill sets you need right now to function properly in this new economy first of all i'm not saying you should know all ah you can't know all. You can just know one. You can learn one. You can focus after this class today. You can put your mind to, oh God, I want to start learning one of these skills. Or, ah, I've been having this skill in mind. Oh. Then you have to position yourself to start learning it. And I'm going to help you with some of them. I'm going to help you with some of them. So one of the skills of the new economy that is here is what? Programming and software development. Programming and software development is a powerful skill set. A lot of people are paying tons of money for it's something you can learn. I have a programmer that can teach you if you're interested. Jamie in on WhatsApp, I'll set you up with him. He's very good in programming. He has trained a lot of people that are doing awesomely well online. So the next skill set is website and funnel hacking. Everybody needs a website or a funnel hacking for businesses. You can position yourself as this as a service and get paid for it. So sales funnel and website designing. Next one is what sales and marketing. Sales and marketing. I'm more into sales and marketing. I, I that's the skill set I have. That's the skill set I'm training myself in. For every business, you will need skill and marketing. Sales and marketing skills for every business. As long as it's business, you will need to learn it. Along even if you learn every other thing, you still come back and learn sales and marketing. If you don't learn it, you have to pay people to do it for you. And it can be quite expensive. Even copywriting. Copywriting is another powerful high income skill. Copywriting. This is the art of what? Using words to sell. Copywriting, another powerful skill. Next one is what? Your UX and UI design or graphic designing. That's another powerful skill. Product design is UX and UI. Another skill is what? Trading the financial market. People, some, some of you might be crypto traders or forest traders already. So this is a, 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 a skill set that helps you make more money online, trading the financial market. Now another skill set is advertising and branding. When I talk about advertising, it's helping people generate traffic. Every business needs traffic, need new clients. So if you can help people generate traffic, you can get paid heavily for that. There's somebody that runs my Facebook ad, I pay him as well. There's somebody that won't build my site, I pay him. As well, so you can get paid doing these current skills. These are the skills that are, that are needed very well in this new economy. Podcast and content creation. I just told you a content creator can be making more money than you as a banker because of people are now value based oriented. Podcasting still has to do with content creators. People that deliver content on um, on TikTok, on YouTube as well. These are skills. There are skills you can learn. I'm telling you. There are skills you can learn. And when you learn them, you start making tons of money. You can create your business around this skill set. Let's get down to the other, um, how to start an online business. How to start an online business. Okay. So, creating an online business takes several processes. But I've decided to emphasize on just three major processes. There are a lot of processes creating an online business help you do. One minute, please. Let me get water. Okay, let me go back. Okay, sorry for that breaking transmission. So there are processes involved in starting an online business. This is now the essence of the class or the main part of the class. How do you start an online business? First of all, you choose a niche or a business idea. You identify the problem you want to solve. You identify the problem you want to solve. 
the first one is the most important process. You don't want to be caught trying to do a lot of things. You first identify the problem you would like to solve. Then you check the market size for that problem. The reason, the reason to generate a lot of sell in a country like ours is because the market size for problem solving is large. The reason generator. Have you noticed that generator sells in Nigeria? We hardly have light. We hardly have light. That's why this this problem, the problem that generator is solving is large. If you want to start a business, find a market that is large. Find a market that the need is large. What problem can I solve in that market? Then you bring a product or a service that fits into that market. It can be on health, it can be on money making, it can be on fashion. What are what are what problem are people lacking? What problem is everybody complaining about that you can fix? After you have choose the niche, you pick identify a problem you can solve. Now after that, you move to the setting up of the environment. That's the selling environment. Where do you wish? Your target audience can reach you and be able to assess your product and your credibility. Is it WhatsApp? Is it Instagram? Is it Facebook? Which particular platform do you want to function in? Make sure you build that environment. Make sure you create and establish what authority in that environment. Mine is WhatsApp for now. So after you have find out, identify the problem you want to solve, where you want to go into, is it a product? Is it a service? Then you pick a selling environment. Don't be everywhere all the time. Pick one place people can know you for. Then the last one is to direct traffic to that selling environment. This is the part a lot of people don't do. They are just busy waiting for miracle. One of the reasons why you don't create customers to your business that you have is because you are not driving traffic to your selling environment. Whether organically or paid traffic, you need to drive traffic consistently to that your selling environment. That's where people will get to know, oh, this is what you are selling, oh, this is what you have, oh, and be interested in buying. So these are the three processes, although they are elaborate, but this is not the class to expand shit on it. This is not the class to expand shit on it. Probably along the line, you will learn more from me. So for you to start an online business, you pick a problem. What problem do you want to solve? What problem can you solve? What problem can your product solve? And make sure the problem you are picking to solve or the product you are picking to sell to fix that problem has a large market. Like the health. The health has a large market. If I sex, things that has to do with sex related, has a large market. Are you getting me? Money making also has another large market. So when you pick a problem you want to solve, you create a selling environment, direct traffic. That's the true process of starting an online business. Now, it takes a lot to start an online business, both capital-wise and time-wise, especially at the early stage. But it's not that complex. It's just following that basic principle I shared with you. But there's another simply w simpler way to doing online business. You can leverage on other people's products. Then you don't have to go through the process of what producing, which will cost you a lot of time and money, and also management, uh, management services. Now, the other way I am trying to say now is the you, you leveraging as a middleman between the buyer and the seller. This is what is called affiliate marketing. Now, in the next business class, which is likely to be tomorrow day two, I will share more with you what affiliate marketing is. So if you can skip this entire process of trying to create your own business or trying to get identify your product, and or you can go into what simply affiliate marketing. Sell other people's product for them. You don't have to produce, you don't have to waste time selecting products. Products are not made available for you. That's affiliate marketing. And in this digital era, you can sell products online without people seeing your face or knowing who you are. As long as it solves their problem and there are testimonies to back your claim up. Same way I shared testimonies with you at the beginning of the class. So now the four positions online business is built around. So for every online business, these are the four positions they are built around. There is no two way around about it. These are the four positions. Now, the four Positions online business is built around is one. Position through selling. This is um, you selling goods, services. It can be digital, it can be physical. Position through rendering of service. 
Well, isn't children in your service is you offering yourself as a somebody that can build sites, somebody that can write a copy, somebody that can do sales and marketing for somebody that's a service too. Like like physically you can plate hair, that's a service. You're not selling any product, you're offering a service. Now another way is for position three investing. You investing, flipping your money. I'll be sharing more with you. I'll, I'll be expanding this part for you. So that you know how, how it goes. Lastly, is positioning through selling. That's selling other people's. I mean, position through affiliating. That's selling other people's what? Product. So the money made from this is called profit. The money made from rendering service is called reward. The money made from investing is called dividends. The money made from affiliate marketing is called what? Commission. You can be doing one of these or you can be doing all depending on your capacity capacity and your availability of time. But when it comes online to online business, you must be involved in one of these. So that you are selling, you are rendering service, you are investing or you are affiliating. Are you getting me guys? So there are several platforms you can leverage on to enjoy this position. And that's what I'll be sharing with you in the next slide. There are several world platforms. Now if you don't have your own business, you can leverage on platforms. Now, this first platform is for you, I and US graphic designer. You can sell what? That's your, you can sell interface to company who wants to what? Build a product. After this class, you can go and check the website out. If you're a US and UI designer, you are not, just leave it. Next one is Team Forest. This is for graphic designers that want to sell templates and logos or banners or flyers. It's a platform you can actually go there, register and sell. Amazon is on that one. These are for people who sell physical products and also ebooks. Now we have Amazon FBA. FBA is for people that sell physical products. We have Amazon KDP. KDP is for people that sell books. Now this is a link I will actually recommend you go and check out after this class. But let me still take it. Copy. Let me open a new tab. Let me open it in a new tab. Let me see if it's open. Let me share an, uh, this, this um, training with you. Let me copy. Let me share this training with you. Okay. Okay, this is it. Amazon KDP Expert. So this training actually teaches you how to sell books on Amazon. As you can see, these are people that are testifying from learning how to do this. Some people making over $1,000 in two weeks, see, through payment. So this is a business model. You can venture into using Amazon. Are you getting me? Okay, good. You can copy the link and check it out after now and register. See, it's just 40k or 30, 39k to sign up. So we have Gigi. This is also a platform that people who sell physical products. This is actually for Nigerians. Gigi. So for selling, position through selling, these are the platforms you can leverage on. Now, position through rendering of service. These are platforms you can uh, leverage on if you are rendering service. Let's just say you have the skill set I told you about to learn. You actually earn a dollar if you have expertise on Fiverr or Upwork. Fiverr or Upwork are freelancing platforms you can offer your service. Now, this is a training tool I will recommend for you. After now, you can copy the link. Let me still show you. Copy link address. Let me still show you. That's it for you to load. So for you that wants to go into rendering of service online, you can learn how to use Fiber and Upwork. And there is a training for you that can look at somebody making over one thousand dollars on that one weekly one thousand five hundred dollars on Fiverr or Upwork. Okay, Upwork. The website design gig, a writing gig of two thousand five. These are testimonies of people that are doing this. And you can learn. That's why I see you can check out this link after this class and you learn from this person. I'm recommending him for you. He's one of the best freelancer tutor you have in Nigeria. Okay, good. Let's continue our class. I believe you are getting value, okay, from this. So, Toring.com is also another platform for developers, for people that are programmers and software de uh, developers. You can get job from the US from this platform, touring.com. So check it out if you are into rendering of service. Next one is investing. As I said earlier, it's not about putting money in 
one platform and expecting a certain ROI or like MMM. So it's, it's, it's you have to what? Use these platforms if you want to make money online. Okay. Let me see if I can pause this and continue. Sorry, let me get something. Is easier than others and less capital consuming. Now, there are platforms you can leverage on which are ClickBank, Expertnia, Lenoflix, JBZoo, CJ Affiliate, Warrior Plus. Now, we all have other model of affiliate marketing which is known as CPA marketing. The platform you can leverage for CPA is GetResponse, Namecheap, HostGator, OneXBet, and OctaFS. But but I will not be teaching about CPA marketing. Probably I'll give you a link one anytime in the future for CPA marketing. But I'm more into what affiliate marketing and the affiliate marketing platform I work with currently is Espania and Lenoflix because they are Nigerian based affiliate marketing platforms. These are platforms you can get started with online and start generating money for yourself. If you want to consider this last part of what positioning online. As an affiliate marketer, you can go into Lenoflix or what expert near. Now, my offer that will help you get started, start your own online business. Now, the truth, the truth is that without it's not trust. I'm going to describe truth. The truth is that without a skill, you won't function properly in the new economy. Your current job might be paying well, low, but what's your backup plan? Or extra source of income. A lot of people we are working in um, in Abuja, this place that got next cash and carry in Abuja that got burnt in Jai. A lot of people that was their job, but I believe nobody predicted the fire that was going to happen that year. Most of them must, might not have had an extra fund for 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 survival till they get another job. So what's your backup plan? I'm telling it you to your face now. Maybe you have a job and you don't have a backup plan. You can leverage on the positions I told you. Through selling, through rendering of service, through investing, or through affiliate marketing, you can leverage on any of those positions online and start making money for yourself. If you think, if you are thinking of how hard it is to put yourself under the pressure of learning something new after your four years degree, you have to go through to secure that job. Then think of your kids or your mom or your siblings or your wife or your husband as well. Would you like to support them with an extra form of luxury? From that your um, extra source of income. Wouldn't you like something like that? Wouldn't you like to get a new phone, a new device, or a vacation, or a new car? If you're into car. Think about the smile you will put on their faces when you are able to provide all these needs for them and more. What keeps me going? That's what keeps me going. Thinking about my mom, my siblings. That's what keeps me going. And that's why I strive to work, create multiple streams of income. My age may see me and they wonder how far I've gone. They're like, ah, for my age, I'm not supposed to have achieved this much. But the secret, the secret is this simple. Things I share with you today are just simply what I'm doing. And I'm going to offer you an opportunity for you to start as well. I listed skills of this new economy, if you can remember. Let's just go back to those skills. Now you can learn to start making money. I told you programming. I told you website. I told you sales and marketing. I told you copywriting. I do the UX and DI design, graphic design, trading, advertising, and podcasting. Now, there is an offer I want to offer you that houses a lot of those skill sets for a, a minimal amount of money. A minimal amount of money. Now, there is something I want you to know. If you want to pay individually for this skill set, it will cost you nothing less than, nothing less than at least 150k each individually to learn. Each of those skill sets I mentioned. Those skill sets is what will help you start your online business. If you learn them, you'll be able to identify problems you can solve with them. Are you getting me? Now, my offer. You can learn all those skill sets I talked about under one umbrella. Instead of having plenty of platforms where you learn them or plenty of teachers, you can have you can learn all those skill sets I mentioned under one umbrella. You can, if you want to learn those skill sets individually from different coaches, I told you it will cost you more. I'm more stressed to log into different platforms or sites for your training. 
everybody is learning online so normalize learning online don't be like ah if it is not physical i cannot understand everything i do it everything i i learned are online my brother my two siblings are currently one is a, a, a website designer that builds sites for me all my platform sites for me land online i paid for him to learn and he learned online and today he's doing something that will cost me nothing less than 100 k to pay a, a, develop, a, a website designer to do for me now he does it for me and i pay or not in most of the time so it's a skill set you can learn online any all these skill sets you can learn them online so that's why i'm recommending you a platform that houses all these skill sets for you to learn and start your own business or rendering of service so lab lelo Flix created a program that guides you through over 14 digital skills website design funny hacking sales and marketing graphic design voiceover copywriting C um, seo facebook and google advertising skill presentation and podcasting i told you about podcasting and lots more all these skills are being taught on their words that pdc program for just a hundred dollars Fifty thousand naira. Trust me, this will be the best investment of your life. Because after the training, you'll be able to do things you never thought you would do. I would love to share testimonies with you of other persons that are already benefiting from this program. But I would like you, if you want to see those testimonies after this class, just come to my DM and type LAP that's LAP Lenoflix, and I will share with you those testimonies. That I see that ah, this is really working. I would have shared it in this class, but it's already getting lengthy. Now, let us do an overview of Lenoflix. Let me take you through a small tour on Lenoflix. Before I come down and tell you my discount offer that I will be sharing with you guys. So, let's go to my Lenoflix dashboard. So, this is my Lenoflix dashboard. We get all this plenty money. No, plenty. So, this is how your Lenoflix dashboard will look like when you sign up, when you purchase the Lenoflix um, learning program. Let us go to classroom. I hope I've not been logged out. Let us go to classroom. It's loading. Let, oh, good. It has load. Now, this is your classroom when you register on Lenoflix. Look at the packages you are getting to learn on that. The CEO of this platform is Sam Harvard. is a big time Dubai based what? entrepreneur. Eight figure entrepreneur on dollar, dollar, not naira. <laughs> Is my ogre, is my boss I'm learning a lot from him. So, this um package here is under the 50k. If you pay for this 50k, you have access to all these packages on this platform to learn that houses all those skills I mentioned. So, this one talks about affiliate marketing, teach you everything about affiliate marketing and how to go about it. So, I'll teach you about website design and SEO, so I'll teach you about content creation. So I'm teaching about WhatsApp hack. The person that is teaching this course is Coach Chinwe. Ah, that woman is, is amazing. She's doing mad figures on WhatsApp. She makes roughly nothing less than one million naira plus every month on our WhatsApp. Selling on WhatsApp, I'm telling you. So something you have to teach. I think this course for individually goes for over I think ten k, I think. But you see on Lenoflix if you pay for that fifty k. Um, this one is one of my boss, Coach Kenny, organic traffic commando. On that part framework let me en let me enter this 30 days program so that you see all the courses you'll be learning for that amount so you see the 30 days training digital training online all the classes are done online they are pre-recorded so when you pay when you register you have access like this so day one talks about copywriting day two copywriting day three you can see element of sales day four you can see power of words copywriting day five teaches you about Copywriting still. The six goes into website designing. The seven, uh, the ten and nine websites. The eleven creating funnel. The twelve organic traffic. So the thirty days is packaged with different over fourteen digital skills. SEO, search. Come on, this this is mad. For, for just fifty k, just fifty k, you cannot get it anywhere. Sorry, let's go back to classroom. You cannot get it anywhere for that amount. This guy is a mad seller. Tony Ho and T Honey. 
Ne de bana nine milyon ya. Last year. Two sales too. So he, you are you are going to be learning from him how to use Instagram to sell. Look at what he'll be teaching you. Everything about Instagram, selling on Instagram, running ads, and optimizing your Instagram page to attract what your clients. So if you sell on Instagram, you are going to be learning more from this guy. So this course goes for just fifty thousand naira. You are going to be getting bonuses, a lot of bonuses as well. And with this, if you purchase this program from Netflix. You also have what ability to what affiliate for them. So if you affiliate, you make sales for them. You make money as well. As you can see, this is my money bonus for affiliating for Lenoflix. So I'm recommending this platform for you, and I'm going to be helping just five people. And to get started, I will be offering just five people. Five people. So if you are here and you with speed of light after finishing just. Get this bonus for me. Five people. I'm going to be taking 5k off the original price of 50k. So you'll be able to pay 45k for this to get access to this platform and learn these digital skills that will help you what make yourself better both in your both in your job and online as well. So all you have to do is to come to my DM. I'll drop my WhatsApp contact at the end of this. And type ready for what Lenoflix. Just type this keyword ready for Lenoflix, and I'll give you bank details to pay and web process what your registration. And if you still have more questions to ask me, just come to my GM and ask. I will answer all your questions. So after payment, I will add it to my personal group and support group as well. So if you are not able to afford this, I have another. If you are not able to afford this. Have something else for you. I call it the Confusion to Clarity Master Class. This is everything you need to know about how to stay on steady wealth creation. It's a 5k class, but I'm giving discounts for just 3000 naira. You can use this link stella.co slash c2c section to get access to pay. So, this is my contact. You can reach me on any of the social media and we can get started. Thank you for staying put. Share your testimony with me on WhatsApp. Do have a wonderful day.